Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Pisces, let's get on with your reading. New week, new month. Let's see, what do we have for Pisces in love? I'm using my very own tarot deck, the Nomad Soul Wire Tarot. So if you're interested to get a copy, uh, check out my Etsy shop. The link is in the description box below. All right, Pisces. Pisces in love. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter in love, in life, and everything in between. Hierophant, good. Five of Wands, Knight of Wands, Ace of Pentacles. At the bottom of the deck, we have the Knight of Pentacles. So Pisces, you're in a situation right now where you are hoping for a... Um, to find someone yeah who can be uh, a good partner for you not just a hookup not just a a perhaps could even be casual yeah but um along the process you want to get to know that person and and see you know um whether that could be a potential partner i feel like there is that desire yeah from you to have um, to find a potential partner in the long run so far, it seems like you have someone in your mind, um, someone in your mind, but this situation you have right now, it's somehow giving you some form of confusion. Yeah, it's confusing you for some reason. It's confusing you. It could be that this person is too relaxed, um, too fun loving for you. <laughs> Yeah, fun loving. It is as if that um, they want to spend time with you. They want to, um, yeah, they want to spend time with you, but there is not much grounding, yeah, in terms of their intentions towards you. But let's get three more cards. What's going on here? Knight of Pentacles. There goes that Knight of Pentacles again. Ten of Wands and. The judgment at the bottom of the deck the emperor it feels like it feels like um expectations may have been misaligned between the two of you um this person may feel like you are uh rushing or your pace is faster than their pace yeah but both of you are wanting success wanting a happy outcome wanting to spend time together enjoy the time together um all happy you know happy go lucky and you know um letting things be this person wants to see how the connection with you will grow and i feel like that is something that you would want to do too but on top of that in your mind you have something you have um the ace of pentacles you can see that there is this uh, big potential in this person to be a partner for you. And it feels like for you, this could be it. Well, the mindset of your person is that they're enjoying their time with you and um, they are not playing, but they are not also rushing. Yeah, but they know that you are on to like wanting a more serious type of relationship you could be planning ahead um that's the vibe that you are giving this person yeah and somehow they know that you are however you talk to this person or you deal with them they can feel that um you're leading up to something I'm not saying that your person is not ready. It's just that I feel like they need more time to get to know you. This could be just a new encounter. Yeah, just a new encounter. On your end, Pisces, since this is a, a new, it's sort of a new connection or a new reconnection, you could feel like this person may have other options aside from you. Yeah, they could be enjoying their time outside. But the thing is, that could be true if you have actually seen them out and about, yeah? Um, for the most part, I feel like this is more of 
you have this feeling, inkling that this person is is having a lot of options. And that thought is actually giving you more confusion yeah, than clarity. But every time you're with this person, every time you talk, every time you communicate, it would feel like they are, they're not playing with you. You know, if they have this time with you to talk, to communicate, um, the connection just flows. Yeah, but the Knight of Wands here is very telling that if they are not with you, if you're not together, this person could feel, you would feel like this person is enjoying their time away from you, which is expected, yeah? But at the same time, you would feel like they are not really thinking about you, yeah? And thus, on your end, you could feel like they may not be, um, you want them to be your potential partner, but they may not be seeing you in the same way. Yeah, so there is that misalignment of, of energy, of expectation. What is this Ten of Wands? Oh, no, it's Two of Wands. Let us see. I feel like your person, Pisces, likes you. This person has somehow good intentions. It's just that their way of communicating, dealing with you, it's very flaky. <laughs> yeah, to start with, perhaps because you don't have that relationship yet. You're not that officially together yet, so... That is kind of expected, you know? Oh, what is this? What is two of wands? The eight of cups and the six of wands. This person wants to be with you, Pisces, um, the chariot. They want to be with you. They want to be in a situation and that is potentially be with you. But they want a connection that is not too emotionally heavy. It doesn't mean that they are not um, emotionally available. But it's just that they want to take things easy and let things um, flow the traditional way. Yeah, You get to know each other, um, go on dates, hang out, spend time together, and see how that chemistry would evolve, how your connection could evolve in a traditional way. No rush, um, no manipulation no future planning, but more of just getting the vibe, yeah? And I feel like once that person sees that this connection with you is not too dramatic, not too heavy, I feel like there is a decision that will be made here, which is the two of wands and the chariot. It's moving forward. Um, they will choose the direction with you to move things forward and get things unstuck, if you're feeling like you're stuck right now. You could feel that you are stuck in the situation right now if in the beginning you already want to, to work in a solid type of relationship. You know, the difference here is one person is somehow aiming for relationship, grounding, um, and things like that, and it's very obvious, yeah? While the other person is just enjoying the moment and getting to know you and see how things go. Not in a player mode tendency, but more of someone who just wants to go the normal way of getting to know each other. And I feel like this person could also have other plans in their life. It could be that they are trying to do well in um, in their job, in their money-making strategies and things like that. And that um, love, the energy of love is or love connections for them. It's not deprioritized, deprioritized, but more of one of the priorities that they have in their life. But we only have 24 hours a day. So some of their time can be allocated for work and some time can be allocated for um, cultivating a relationship. I feel like you have not really talked enough just yet, at least in aligning your expectations. You may be talking, yeah, you may be talking about what concerns you, what makes you feel conflicted at some point, or you may be talking about, you know, if they are dating someone else. But the core essence here is have you talked about um, 
your current intentions towards one another. Yeah. I feel that there is sincerity here, but then the pace could be different for both parties. One person would want to work, you know, when you meet someone, you want to work towards gearing into a relationship right away. You have someone here who is of a different composition, a person who wants to enjoy the time, feel the vibe and, and see and let things grow naturally. Yeah. And I feel like if there is less drama, less emotional um, bonding, uh, no, not bonding, but less emotional um, attachments, you will feel, you will get to a point, Pisces, where this person will give you more attention. They would want to win you more than anything else. And I feel like if they have other options right now, you would get escalated. You will be that person that they would put all their focus into. What is judgment here? Yeah. And I feel like they will make that decision. At the bottom of the deck, we have the four of wands. I feel like Pisces, um, ultimately, this person will make that decision to pursue you. Uh... The difference here is that this person would want to feel more of the vibe with you before they could really progress into thinking more seriously about the future. While in your end, in the beginning, I feel like you like this person and um, you feel like there is a good potential with them and that um, you kind of want to do more yeah, to get them on board to get them on board. But if you just let things um, flow naturally at its uh, natural pace, you'll get what you want. You have the, um, the four of wands here, which is celebration. For some of you, this could be like getting together and um, you know discussing about being in a true blue type of relationship, um, perhaps even exclusivity, perhaps even... Um, a deeper, rather more deeper connection that both of you could enjoy fully. Yeah, that, that's what I'm getting in this storyline. I'm going to leave it at that and let me know if this resonates in the comments section below. And don't forget to hit like and subscribe.